Yo, what is up guys? It is William back here with another video. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to create your own Minecraft server with mods. Uh, so I'm gonna be showing you guys the simplest way to do it. You will not need to download anything, uh, yeah. So first thing you wanna do is head to eternos.org. Go down to the button where it says play. Now you guys are gonna want to sign up. You need to enter your username and agree uh, to the privacy policy. I'm gonna name it mods mods server tutorial. You can either have a password and an email or you can sign in with Google. Alright guys and then you log in and this screen should show up. You want to press create a server. I'm going to name it it will be a server.eternos.me I'm gonna make it mods tutorial server and if you want to have a custom domain you need to do something else for that but i'm just simply showing you guys how to do a mods tutorial then you can do welcome to the server of the mods tutorial now you can choose the bedrock or java edition i'm going to choose java edition you guys are going to want to press create Then you'll be on a screen like this. To start your server, you press this button, you wait a bit, make sure you press confirm if it comes up, and then your server will be online and you'll just need to go to this IP address. Otherwise, you can connect to this IP address, which is the exact same, um, and the ports here. So, first thing you wanna do to get mods is you want to go down where it says software and click on that. You guys want to press on any one that says for mods. For an example, Forge, Fabric, pretty sure that's it, or Magma, or you can do mod packs. And for Bedrock, you'll do Pocket Mine. Oh no, that's for plugins, uh, but yeah. So I'm going to choose Forge. Now you guys are going to need to choose the Minecraft version you're going to do it on. I'm going to choose 1.16.4. You guys want to press install. It will, uh, tick symbol will come up and now you have the mods selection thing. You want to click on that. Here you can install any mods into your server. So I'm going to look for a mod and I'm going to install it. I'm going to install 101 dimensions. You click on the mod you want or you can search for one. You need to make sure there are compatible versions though. For an example, this one doesn't have any compatible versions for 1.16.4. If you really can't find any, you guys are going to need to change your version to an earlier version. Right guys, I reinstalled Forge for Minecraft version 1.12.2 because there were just no mods for 1.16.4 because it's very, very recent. Now we'll try 101 dimensions again. Now you can see there is one version that will work with 1.12.2. You wanna go here and press this download button. Wait until it shows up the tick. All right guys, now if you go to files, you'll see that there are, if you go to mods, 101 dimensions.jar. So now you have mods. You can store as many as you want uh, and yeah. You press this button if you want to edit how much players can join, what software or whatever it is. And uh, guys, to start up your server, you press the start button. Press it. yes, I accept the EULA. Press OK. Now, I'm not going to start up my server, but that's what you guys actually need to do to get mods working on a server. You just need to get you and your friends to add this um, IP and it should work. But yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe. If you need any more further help, make sure you let me know in the comments or join my Discord server, which is in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.